This video looks at the interactive teaching resources that form such a fundamental part of Wordsmith. The interactive teaching pages, or ITPs, are intended to give you everything you need for front of class work, both for introducing and teaching a concept, and for reinforcing it with group activities. So what is an ITP and what does it do? Well, an ITP could be anything from a song or a video, to an image, to a drag and drop activity, to a mini ebook. All of the ITPs come with an annotation toolbar that allows you to write on top of the ITP, highlight elements of it, or add different styles of thought and speech bubbles. Each unit plan contains links to the ITPs you will need as you go along, so you can launch them quickly and easily as the lesson is running. So, using the plan for the Year 1 Fiction unit as an example, you will see that the ITPs are indicated at the appropriate place in the running scheme of the lesson, as well as in the summary box for each session. An ITP might be as simple as a single image, such as this, that offers a visual stimulus for discussion. However, most of the ITPs will have some kind of interactive component, as the name suggests. Let's look at some of those next. Many of the ITPs include drag and drop functionality, like this one to help you teach your class about story sequencing. When it comes to grammar, extensive care has been taken to make sure that the discrete grammar sessions, or grammar blasts as they're known in Wordsmith, are active, varied and fun. See for example the sentence song. And to help you create poetry stars in your year one live unit, who could be better than Mr Michael Rosen? My brother comes in and says, tell him to clear the fluff out from under his bed. And mum says... All of the information you need to use the ITP is in the teaching summary or activity description in the unit plan. Here's an example of an ITP that supports a shared writing activity. First of all, you'll read the whole story through with your class, perhaps asking two good readers to take the parts. Next, you return to screen one explaining that you're now going to write this text in sentences. Ask the children to help name the characters and rehearse an opening sentence at an appropriate language level. Often the ITPs will have a corresponding worksheet so you can reinforce your whole class work with individual or paired work. Each unit comes with anywhere between 5 and 25 ITPs. Over 6 years and 5 unit types, that adds up to a really wide and varied bank of lesson materials for you to draw on.